Hello and welcome to The Sound Test Room. My name is Jakob Hack. I'm your host and you're watching a hack vlog. I don't know if you've noticed, but I haven't put up any videos for the last past four or five days. I've been really, really busy working on videos for developers. It's paid work and I need to do that to make a living. During winter times, my regular job isn't on, pretty much unemployed. So I have to find other ways to make money. And so far I've been able to do this and that here and there, small amounts of water and you land up with an ocean. It didn't translate well. It's something we say in Swedish. I'm sure you have something similar in your cultures. I love doing tutorials because I know it's going to help someone. And if I can get paid doing it, that's great. Because I've been working hard on my YouTube channel for little over a year. If you watch the first episodes and the first videos I did and watch what I'm doing today, you can see the level of quality has been upped quite a lot, substantially. And I always try to make everything I do better in some way if it's in sound or in the picture the the way stuff looks the way I talk everything I always keep that in mind when I do my videos I want to be able to provide you with some quality stuff and now it's gotten to the point where my stuff is at a level of quality that I can actually provide developers who want demos or tutorials being made of their products or their apps I can actually provide them with a paid service so what I'm doing right now is I'm actually actually working on my own personal website, just Jakob Hack at Squarespace, I think. If you go check it out now, you'll not find anything. I'm working on it and I don't have it online yet. So it's going to be all there, my rates and everything. I've always wanted to run my own company in some way and I've found something to do that actually makes sense to me. That site is taking a lot of time to work on. And as I said, I'm also working on videos for developers and that takes time too, a lot of time. There's a lot of things you have to think about. When I make a video for a developer usually those videos they're viewed by people who might not like me or might not know who I am so I have to make sure that the message comes across very very clear and I have to make sure I don't miss anything there's so many things I have to think about with my own videos I feel comfortable it's my space so I can do what I want with it but when I'm working for someone being paid for it uh, different kinds of rules so my own website is gonna come up within the month I hope and there developers will be able to find my rates portfolio of my previous work and stuff thank you so much for staying with me through my fast-paced droolings and as usual Doug Woods Colin Sweeney and me Jakob Hack at which is you a very productive week now go finger your surfaces like that and have a lot of fun doing it